We've all seen the highlights from the Golden Globes, but Diva Gal's daily editor in chief, Delena Dixon, has the dish on the hottest parties. Delena, take it away. Yes, Sonia, there were a ton of parties after the Golden Globes. Now, Mariah Carey held court at the Warner Brothers in style party with the likes of Selma Hayek and Ashley Judd. Michelle Williams brought as her date to the award ceremony the founder of the Me Too movement, Tarana Burke. But when she got to the party, she got to hang with her bestie, Busy Phillip. Now, Fox took home the most awards for the night for all their different divisions. That's TV, film, and Hulu. Frances McDormand was at the party. She actually took home one of the awards for best performance and three billboards outside of Ebbing, Missouri. HVO might have been the easiest party to get to. It was held right outside of the Beverly Hilton Ballroom where the awards broadcast took place. Now, the cast of Big Little Lies was there, and that includes Nicole Kidman, who just joined Instagram, if you haven't seen her pictures, and she spent most of the night granting selfies. All right, from one reason to celebrate to another, you have all the details on Gwyneth Paltrow's recent engagement. Yes, Sonia, congratulations are in order because Gwyneth Paltrow is engaged. Now, she's engaged to producer Brad Falchuk, and she gave us a little bit of a hint that they were ready for a conscious coupling. She posted a picture on her Instagram of her and her boo. They were sitting around. It was a lazy Saturday, and they were watching their favorite TV shows. Now, there's no word on a wedding date yet, but the happy couple is on the cover of Gwen's magazine, Goop. And yes, Gwen is still close to her ex-husband, Chris Martin. They co-parent their two children. Thank you, Delena, for more more stories like these, make sure you head to divagalsdaily.com.